Hear ye, hear ye, presenting the Music Station Radio Hour. Music Station. Radio Hour. Music Station. Radio Hour. Hello, this is your announcer, Coco Taylor. Here's your hosts, Papa and Tautai. And we're here with the legendary Dan Holmes Group. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Uh, it looks like we have... Um, yeah? It's... I've seen this guy before. Yeah. It's Andy, and, Andy on sax. Andy on sax. Hey. Hi, Andy. The mic works. The That's mic weird. does I work. got this like delay thing. I thought he was mimicking somebody no. else. I don't know what that was. He looked like uh, one of those uh, overdubbed Chinese movies. That's what it was. That's kind of weird. That doesn't work. Andy, so we're we've doing got, radio. It uh, doesn't work when We you also that. have uh, Bill Ritter over here on bass. Hey, Bill. Hey, what's going on? The public speaks. The, no, we that was Bill. That wasn't the public. That was Bill. Oh, that was Bill. Back on drums, Mr. Steve Bruner. Steve Bruner. Hello. Hi. Hey. Wake up, America. That's right. Listen that was, up. That was nice. That's over. Wow. It's okay, like delivering just a think, message. Is he running? We for have something? an hour of this. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> People are turning their dials right now. An hour of that? I can't believe that. And then, of course, we have the 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 namesake of the group. Yes. Over there on the keys. Dan Holmes. Group. How's it going? How are you? <laughs> what's up, Dan? Good to see you. Dan Holmes Group. What's up with Dan Holmes Group? Dan Holmes Group Where'd is like a. Um, uh, how would we describe ourselves? We're kind of we're kind of Cajun-y. We're kind Cajun-y. of kind of New Orleans-y. We're Cajun-y. kind of bluesy. We're kind of lots of thingsy. There's lots of things going on there, and it's an excellent sound. So, and it's technical. It's really technical. Hi, Andy. Sometimes I don't get it. Okay. <laughs> let's do a song. Let's uh yeah let's uh let's kind of gel together. We'll bow our heads, do a little bit of prayer. We're going to start with a song named Hurricane. Hurricane. This is off of the uh, album, um, this is off the album Pure, which came out a few years ago. And, uh, I know it is, that album. Get a copy. All right, That's so it. Hurricane off of Pure. Here goes. Dan Holmes Group. in the middle of a hurricane in spring makes me stop and wonder why do I do these things far away from problems I came back for them again I'll leave them way behind me soon I just don't know when I feel the wind start blowing at 90 miles an hour Try to get away, but I can't move against its power It pushes me in places that I just don't want to go How am I to fight a wind when I can't see it blow? I feel when the storm looks for someone to blame Just having fun People getting panicked While I sit and watch them run Forced to leave or fight the storm I can't make up my mind And maybe if I choose to stay Who knows what I will find All of my possessions are packed tidily away Maybe when the storm has passed, I'll get to them someday. My sister says I'm crazy for standing here so long. Said leave before it kills you. I sure hope she's wrong. I'll fill with the storm. Look for someone to blame.
storm has now subsided Another day chalked up for loss Another place demolished Another path to cross I recollect my senses And rejuvenate my strength I survey the damage done Ten football fields in length Pretending nothing happened I'll go on from day to day Watching for the next time That the storm will blow my way Easiest solution is for me to run from town But I think I'm gonna stay Until the next one blows me down I'll fill with the storm Look for someone to blame And now I'm standing in a hurricane A hurricane I'm standing in Outstanding, gentlemen. Yeah. All right. It's deep. It's moving. Hurricane. Hurricane. DanHolmesGroup.com. That's it. That was interesting. Andy, you got a brother that plays sax? Uh, yeah. He's, he's, he's my twin. Is that what it is? Yeah. Because I... Uh, I'm going through some deja vu or It's something. the Copus Boys. It's the Copus Boys on sax. There are uh, It'd be really cool if one of you did baritone Andy. and one does... It's kind of cool because... Uh, They're all named Andy. Anytime one of the Copuses gets sick, I just hire the other one to come in and take his place. Nobody knows the difference. That's right. It's great. Do you wear a wig or something? I thought one of you, <laughs> one of the, one of them Copus boys had a mullet or something like that. It seemed like it. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Well, you know, that's something you don't see. You don't see a sax player with mullets. No, that's true. That's weird. There nope. was a sax player with uh, Pink Floyd back in the mid '80s. He had a mullet. He just recently. Uh, when did he die? He didn't die, did he? He didn't die. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> All right. Stimulating conversation from Andy Copus. <laughs> this is Stimulating. why we don't talk about sex on the no radio. No doubt. Yeah, okay. everybody's... <laughs> yeah, so, uh, hey, hey, Bill, how did you end up hooking up with this group? Uh, well, it was a long, long time ago, and I answered an ad in the paper. Um, <laughs> that no, ad? I don't know. I've, I've known Dan for a long time. I used to beat up on him when he was a little kid, and I guess he felt like he owed it to me. I don't know. <laughs> That's, Thanks, Bill. That's a heart rendering story. <laughs> Are they related? Are they related? Um, Bill Dan is and Bill? Bill is my uh, brother's wife's brother. Brother's wife's brother. It's my brother's wife. You can get married. Brother, yeah, we could get married. You could get married. <laughs> yes, we could. But I wouldn't recommend it. In Massachusetts, anyway. No, yeah. When when we were oh. when we were little kids, actually, Bill oh. Bill was good friends with my sister. And uh, he, they used to come over all the time and give me and my little punk friends wedgies to the ceiling. And, right on. You know. <laughs> wedgies to the ceiling. I can't have any children because of Bill. Hey-o. Hey-o. And what, what about that drummer guy? Where'd you uh, find him? Steve Bruner. Yeah. Uh, that's Mr. Steve. Did I sit up there, Bruner? Right. Did I sit up there? Did he sit up there? <laughs> Bill, Bill invited me to Dan's band. Dan didn't want me, but Bill said, "No, you oh, know, it happened for you gotta chance. Give him a chance. Give him, come on. He's a young, aspiring musician. Give him a shot. Oh, well, he's a drummer. <laughs> he doesn't have well, a gig. The one thing, the one thing about these guys that's really kind of cool is a long time ago when I was recording, and actually, Bill's the one that got me into recording years ago. Ten years, ten years. Wow, was wow, it ten, ten years, years ago? ago? Man. Man, you guys should he, be married. He got me into into recording like ten years ago, and uh, I, he told me about Steve. And Steve was playing with a group called uh, Buzzy Jones. Buzzy Jones, weren't you? Sure, we all know Buzzy Jones. So. Yeah, they yeah. good band. Did you guys they, have a sax player named Andy? 
think so. <laughs> I think everybody's had a sax player <laughs> named Andy. Well, he he was in that band, and uh, Bill Bill told me about him and said that that he was a really good drummer, and I should have him in. And we met and did some things, and ended up having Bill and Steve play on. He's pretty good. He has some tempo album. issues, but he's pretty good. That's true. <laughs> And, you know, I, I know it's probably not coming across on the air, but uh, Steve actually usually sings. What? what? He usually sings. But uh, it's one of those things where as he's playing a beat, he has this little... <laughs> well, he's playing. I don't know. Yeah. I'm actually in key sometimes. Yeah, but it's, it's just very rare. the wrong key. It's yeah. the wrong... He's in a key. <laughs> it's somebody's key. <laughs> It's a Haitian That's key. That's right. It's like, yeah, if we were playing in Haiti, that would be the right key. That's right. That's it. It's, it's weird. All right, so what do we got there? Is it time? Um, is it time? Sure. Is it time for us to do... So where'd Papaw go? Hey. Oh, there he is. Sorry. sorry I, thought... I was in the other room uh, <laughs> Papaw, doing... Uh, Papaw fell asleep. I was, I was doing the mixing board. Sorry. Okay. So today, I think it's time once again for us to do one of our uh, uh, timed, treasured classics. Which one? For... Uh, we're going to have to uh, the lyrical thing of calling bass player recites the lyrics. Ladies and gentlemen, the next sounds you will hear will be Bill Ritter reciting some very cool lyrics. Okay, um, are you ready, Bill? Sure. Now, sure. I, now we don't want you to uh, sing these. Don't sing them, Bill. Oh wait, my God! Wait, don't sing them. <laughs> We don't want you to say the title. Oh my God! Don't just, say those. just uh, read these first two paragraphs poetically. Poetically. Dramatically. Dramatically. Are you ready? Here, Here it comes. Here we go. This is Bill Ritter gentlemen. reciting the lyrics. Sometimes you want to take you down. Sometimes I want to get you low. Brush your hair back from your eyes. Take you down. Let the river flow. Sometimes I gonna walk the street. Behind a green sheet of glass, a million miles below their feet, a million miles, a million miles. Yeah. Yes. Excellent. Bill excellent Ritter reading an of excellent low rendition. Cracker. Of Low by Cracker. Low by Cracker. That's ironic that we're talking about, you know, Dan and Bill being married in the state of Massachusetts and he throws that song at you. Cracker? That's, That's true. That's right. That's weird. That's weird. That's an odd thing. That's are, excellent. Are, are you guys ready to do another song? Yeah. Okay. Or uh, more music. Okay. You guys ready? More music from the Dan Holmes group. Stop a minute, feast your ears on the story. I got something everybody should know. If you find a diamond in the raw, stop looking cause you found enough. The waste of time I found out long ago On me and mine, well, we aren't without problems I call her up on the telephone Well, she hung up once, she hung up twice Never takes any of my advice She can't hear nobody but her own She says I forget what's in
the sky, I thought I saw her staring Yeah, daydreaming of things she thought should be I ask her what she's thinking of Smiling, she says my true love She sometimes makes me wonder if it's me Just when I thought the end was coming Yeah, I packed my bags and I closed my suitcase She said, honey, please don't go I said, baby, I don't know How can I leave with tears upon her face? You might think we are never happy And maybe we do need a little space Sit at home, she can always put a smile on my face. Oh, you can chase the rat for looking for your pot of gold. Wish upon a million stars, but remember you've been told. Wish ain't gonna make it better. You gotta know that you'll never regret it. I'll let her have some of your thoughts. Wish ain't gonna make it better I'd rather know that you never regret I let her have some of your thoughts to hold Oh, you can chase a rainbow Looking for a pile of gold I Wish upon a million stars But remember you've been told I Wish ain't gonna make it better She gotta know that you never regret her I let her have the some thought dogs to hold. Yeah! Right on. Yeah, yeah. 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 Excellent. Smoking song. Yeah. I mean, that doesn't make me want to smoke, but no, it's no. a smoking song. It, it was a song that was uh, written for my ex-girlfriend, who's now my wife. <laughs> <laughs> wow, there you go. There you go. That's that, excellent. That's what happens. I don't have one of those. Oh, you have an ex-girlfriend that's your wife that's now an ex-wife. Well, yeah. That, oh. maybe that's what, what? That's, a that's weird. That's weird. That's right. Bill? We need to uh, <laughs> pause for a commercial break. Is that right? <laughs> that's right, yeah. Okay. Uh, we were having too much fun, so we need to pay some bills. Uh, we'll pause for a commercial break. Be right back with the Dan Holmes Group. That's them. Hi, this is Duke Tomato, and you're listening to the Music Station Radio Hour. And we're back. Yeah! We're back Woo! once again! DanHolmesGroup.com. <laughs> That's it. That, that Dan Holmes Group. <laughs> so uh, I think we should do our, our next uh, segment, don't we you? We should do the next segment. Okay. Which is, are you ready for this? Oh, yeah. Ask yes. the, the drummer, drummer a question. question. Tatai will now read from 2004 Trivial Pursuit Edition. Ask Steve Bruner a question. Are you ready, Steve Bruner? Uh, yes, I'm ready. <clears throat> <clears throat> what language has more native speakers than any other in Canada after English and French. I, I got to go with Chinese. Wow. <laughs> that is unbelievable. <laughs> and let's thank Andy for that answer. All right. <laughs> Andy Copas. Yay. Sorry, sorry, Steve. You can't keep the record Steve on that. Steve doesn't get it. No, but it was really close. And that's an un- unusual question. I had no idea with that. I didn't know there were that many Chinese in Canada. Well, why would you? You're here. That's true. I mean, not that it, not that it says. <laughs> A third of the planet is Chinese. Are they all in Canada? Wait, I don't get it's that. It's very strange. We'll have to ask Southside Denny. I don't, I don't get that. <laughs> Denny knows everything. Denny knows everything about Canada. That's what that's all about. He knows Canada. That's right. He well, does. it doesn't say that they're all Chinese, but they all speak it. All right. That's what that question is. Can we play another to. song? Yeah, okay. I have nothing else to danholmesgroup.com. say. There we go. I just got to keep plugging that. That's it. Play us um, a song. Okay. Um, I'd like to do a song that's not available yet. Uh-oh. It's, it'd be an exclusive right here to... Uh, Can we buy it? Music Station Radio Hour. Um, soon, you'll be able to buy it. 
It's going to be on an upcoming album called Burning Down. Burning Down. Burning Down. Now, this An exclusive is, on the Music Station Radio Hour. This song is a song called Neighborhood. Two, Here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> All that's left is some scraps of wood It seems to me that it burned all night And now nobody is feeling right When the Nyoman came It was such a shame They would help if they could In the neighborhood Yeah! Two men got in and they pulled a knife On the one of Joe and his wife He tied them up and expressed the rules He took the money and all the jewels When the neighbors distressed No one got any rest And they would help if they could He grabbed his chest and his face turned red Before they knew it, two weeks had passed No one could say when they saw him last When the ambulance came Nobody knew his name And they would help if they could Neighborhood. Neighborhood. That's a good song. Neighborhood. Thank you. That's good. Thank you. Thank you. That was uh, Andy Copas on Shaker. Shaker. Sweaty. Was that what that was? Shaker. Sweaty Shaker. Sweaty. Sweaty Shaker. That's right. <laughs> Here in the studio. Yeah. The sauna. The sauna. That's what it is. We come to the part where we know that there's somebody psychic in this group, and it's actually Dan Holmes. Dan Holmes is psychic in the group. No. I, I knew that. He knew that. He doesn't even have to say anything. I don't have we to say We all know. It. He's psychic. That's right. That's okay. Nice. So we have... Um, we have a sealed envelope here. There is it sealed. Andy will confirm that it is sealed. It is sealed. There you go. Okay. As far as the sax player knows, it's sealed. Well, what am I to do and, here? And Dan, you just kind of kind of look at the envelope I have in my hand. Okay. Kind of feel the vibe. Okay. Know the vibe. All right. I got the vibe. Okay. <laughs> I, I understand it. You tell me the answers. What's in the envelope? That's right. Um... I, 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 I see the words um, tasty. Tasty. I see the word giraffe. Giraffe. And I see the word square. Square. That's right. Let's open the envelope and... And wow. It, it's amazing. He had it dead on. Tasty? Well, tasty. It's more like... How did you spell Tasty. Um, I can't spell. I can just see. Oh, okay. Because it's actually spelled tasty with two E's. So I don't know if that has to do with ice cream or something like no. that. It's weird. It's weird. But he had it. Let's do a song. All three of them. Please. Yes. Can we do a song? <laughs> Let's move on. 
Um, What's the question? It doesn't matter. There wasn't a question. There was no it was question. just, just three down. things in the envelope. Three things written down. Okay. <laughs> All right. We're going to do another. Uh, what song are we doing out there, Dan? Uh, this is going to be off of our album called Pure, and uh, it's called Ghosts in the Attic. Ghosts in the Attic. Okay. Are you ready? .com. I suspect the spect is near when I feel that frightening fear. I who do voodoo here to make my problems turn to tears, raising hell and havoc. There's ghosts up in my attic. scary it's cool but scary yeah well there you go we try this is 60 no. minutes of entertainment packed into two hours that's it that's I stretched it. over two hours that's very nice skinned over two hours that's all right that's right okay so uh bill ritter over here on base how, how did you meet steve bruner uh steve and i played in a band together called the slam actually it was called the joneses i think first and then the slam the, the joneses slam, the, the you know joneses the and, uh, and then it came the Buzzy, Buzzy Joneses, Joneses. Slam, the Slam, Slam, Buzzy, Slam, Buzzy, Slam Buzzy Jones, Slam 
Joseph's grand slam. So anyway, we met and um, played the tri-state area and frat parties and the whole fun thing. Oh, this is a college thing. It was a college thing. Right on. And uh, so... What kind of hair did Steve have then? Uh, the same as he has now. Is that right? Yeah, exactly. He's he hasn't had changed that any. That's right. We should buy him a comb. Oh, I had a little more. What's that? I had a little yeah. more hair. It was fuzzier? Yeah. Uh-oh. Lot, Uh-oh. We're giving away what Steve looks fuzzy, like over the fuzzy air. Fuzzy Jones? <laughs> he was fuzzy. <laughs> he was That's fuzzy. right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Do you want us to do another one? I think we should do more. I mean, okay. we're, we're on a roll, so we're we should just roll. keep going. Let's do another one. Let's get it. All right. Uh, um, how about one of our favorite uh, cover songs? Uh, yeah, one of your favorite cover songs is probably one of our favorite cover songs. Yeah, I know it is. Okay. okay. Are Here you ready? Go. Uh, We're almost there. DanHolmesGroup.com.
Ta-ta. Where'd that song come from? Uh, that's a that's a Professor Longhair made that song famous. Um, but why should everybody, everybody know who Professor Longhair is? Professor Longhair is like the greatest pianist from New Orleans. There you anyway. go, Professor Longhair. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's uh, relative. Yeah, but I enjoy him. He's cool. He is very cool. We like him. We Makes like him. We want to get up and dance. Do you like him, Andy? Yeah, he's great. He's great. He's awesome. He's, he's awesome. awesome. Who's your favorite sax player? Uh, probably Michael Brecker. Okay, enough of you. Who's your favorite bass player? <laughs> oh man, it's a it's a tie between Stanley Clark and Getty Lee. That's a big Getty that's Lee. A, that's that's wild. Wow, that's a wide range. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. We can we could do some uh, Getty Lee. I guess. Who's your favorite drummer? Uh, I think I'd have to go with Ringo Starr. Ringo, Ringo Starr, very good. Subtle. That's right. Subtle. Yeah. Less is more. We should do that song. We're not going to do that now. Not going to do it now. Go ahead. Come on. I bought some milk and some cereal. I bought some shoes made from a suede material. I bought a dog toy for my little boy. The superstore's got it all. A jigsaw and a sheet of drywall Some shampoo and drops for my eyeball A paper towel and a big plastic owl The superstore's got it all Fluorescent hum over aisles of gum While my dreams float through the rafters All of the games keep a calling my name This can only turn out in disaster I bought a book and a magazine I bought a rug and chocolate chip ice cream I bought some pantyhose and some spray for my nose The Superstore's got it all While my dreams float through the rafters All of the games keep a calling my name This can only turn out in disaster I bought a plant and a window drape Pudding and some more duct tape A can of flea spray and an ATV tray The Superstore's got it all An oven glove and all of my love the Superstore The Superstore's got it Got it all The Superstore's got it all The Superstore's got it all The Superstore's got it all They got all my money at the Superstore They got everything, everything at the Superstore Possibly want or need some things I don't need. The superstore's got it all. The superstore's got it all. The superstore's got it all. Superstore! Superstore! That's kind Steeper. of a generic term. We're not talking about any specific. No, superstore. no, no, no. That's on. Uh, that's gonna be. That's actually not been released yet. That's not been released yet. That's gonna be on the forthcoming album called Burning Down. Burning Down. More Do exclusive out. material right. here on the Music Station Radio. That's hour. right. Actually, uh, yeah, we, yeah, we wrote Dan it. Holmes Group. We just wrote it. Like, like while we were on commercial break. That's it. <laughs> we wrote it because we heard just all the ads down, for all the, the cool grocery stuff. list. That's right. Just needed all that stuff. That's and, right. Pantyhose and some spray for my pantyhose, nose. Spray, you know, and I don't. I don't even know if that's because the pantyhose is around your nose. I don't know why. Why, why that's there. <laughs> All right. He's always got to take it somewhere. <laughs> He's always got to take it somewhere. Pantyhose on my nose. That's right. Now, um, while we were on break, we were talking about you know some some stories of the band and uh, you know Steve. Did I sit up there, Bruner? Has did I sit up there? Where Where's that come from? <laughs> yeah, oh well, I guess Bill Bill Ritter could explain that one. Uh, right. Bill Ritter, bass player extraordinaire. 
I don't know if I can explain it or not, but I used to live in a condo that had like a just a loft above a closet, and Steve was for some reason thought he sat up there at some point in time, and he just wouldn't let it go. He's like, "Are you sure I didn't sit up there at one point in time?" That like, is Steve, bizarre. dude. You know, no. <laughs> All right, wild let, times. let it go. Just let it go, Steve. So there you that's go. very nice. So did he ever just like get up there and? <laughs> did he ever sit? get up there? I I you think yeah, he did? Yeah, I think he still thinks he got up there, although I don't think he ever did. No, not really. <laughs> That's right. I gotta, I gotta tell Just you, when, sit there. when we were recording um, that album, Steve, Steve would come over all the time, and and uh, by the end of the night, it was it was always awesome. Steve is one of these guys that he's one of the most creative musicians that I know. He's also one of like a serious propeller head too. He knows, oh no! Yeah, he is. He's he's an IT guy. He's an IT guy. <laughs> he he knows everything they used to know about computers. So yeah. I always have him come over and help me with that kind of stuff. But, oh, well, there you go. But uh, when we were recording the album, uh, he'd come over and he'd put in input, and I'd tell him, you know, I, you know, I, when I was writing this song, I really wanted this drum part to, you know, do this one certain thing, and he just. Mm, no, <laughs> <laughs> that's not gonna hurt. That's like, and by that's the end of the somebody. night, I don't know how we stayed friends through that period. Because by the end of the night, every night, you kind of went home. And he was always kind of exasperated, and I was always kind of frustrated. And what was that all about? You know, he'd, he'd go home after being at my house for four or five hours recording, and and not get what I want, and then. I'd listen to it a few days later, and some of it would be cool, and some of it would be crap, and he'd come back. It was that next <laughs> session. It was that next session. He came by with a drum machine. That's right. Well, <laughs> so, there you it go. was it was most of the sessions that I couldn't use because he was humming on all the tracks. Oh well, there you go. <laughs> Excellent. It was great. It was good having him there. Closet Hummer. It was very good. And so far, Andy has yet to appear uh, on a Dan Holmes project. No, I have not. <laughs> <laughs> Neither, none of the Andes. That's none funny. of the, what was it, four? That's funny. Three or four Andes that, that we know of. Yeah. And uh, so far, I mean, basically, besides gigging all the time, really the only things that uh, we kind of all do, I mean, we never hang out together. We should. I, I hang out a little bit with Steve every once in a while. I don't know. While. I'm standing in this room right now, and I have the smell coming out of here. I know. <laughs> I don't know. Well, hey, you want us to uh, play another? Uh, let's see. Let's look at the big hands yeah. on the clock. Sure. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we got time. We got we plenty got time. of time. Let's do another song. All right, here we go. As she spun around Slipped on the blood as she came down Fell through the air, never made a sound Never felt nothing as hard as the ground Oh, she got through the afternoon Oh, evening is coming soon Oh, she got through the afternoon
Violet Moon. Violet Moon. That's on the upcoming album too. You guys are getting That's all sorts of exclusive, upcoming. exclusive Everything material. Is exclusive here. That's right. Please visit danholmesgroup.com. Um, you oh. can hire Andy for your band. Uh, Why not? <laughs> Jump on the bandwagon. <laughs> uh, I'd like to thank you guys for having us on the air. Hey, thank you guys for being here. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. No, really, thank you guys. No, everybody. Yeah, We're just about out of time, but we'd like to get one more song out of you. Okay, well, we may. I don't know whether we have time for this or not, but we'll... Hey, we'll do what we can. We'll play until you fade us out, That's right. We're just going to keep playing okay. until, until the night is over. And again, thanks for having us on uh, the Music Station Radio Hour. Music Station Radio Hour. We'll see you next week. Baby, she got great big feet She long kinda like I had nothing to eat But she my baby And I love her just the same I'm crazy about your baby I count on you using me I count on ya, count on ya What makes your big head so hard? I love ya And I want you just the same I'm crazy about your baby I count on you using me My mama said, leave that little girl alone. No kidding, that's what she said. She said, son, you better stay away. My mama didn't know what she was talking about, but I did. Now, I got to go back to her once more. I mean, once again. A Caldonia, Caldonia. What makes your big head so hard? I love you, and I want you just the same. I'm crazy about you, baby. Leave that little girl alone. Oh, no kidding, that's what she said. She says, ah, You better stay away. My mama didn't know what she was talking about, but I did. I gotta go back to her once more. I mean, once again. I count on ya, count on ya. What makes your big head so hard? I love ya, and I want ya just the same. I'm crazy about you, baby. I count on you today. Radio Hour. It's like being on a diet of chocolate. Music Station. Radio Hour. Music Station. Radio Hour.